Hi, you guys. Oh my gosh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No, no. Whoa. Hi. Here we are starting this vlog. <laughs> the past like 24 hours have been a whirlwind. So, starting off this vlog in New Jersey, Brody and I just drove here during the day since. Hey buddy. Max got called up last night and there's a home game tonight, but he's just taking warm up, so not gonna go. And literally starting to blizzard and it's also getting dark. So sorry, the lighting is like not good. I don't know if you can tell, it's gonna snow a lot, a lot. But it's honestly good. I think that we came here instead of being in Utica because it's gonna snow so much more in Albany and Utica, it's gonna be like the biggest winter storm. So Brody and I are like, we will come. And they actually leave for a long road trip. They go on like long road trips in the NHL instead of the HL. So they go to Florida, they play like in Tampa, Fort Lauderdale, is that where the Panthers play? I think all that. And then Brody and I will go back to Utica. Hopefully the roads won't be as bad but they were just getting bad. Like literally Brody and I got here. We're like, hi Max, hi Max. He left to go to the rink. He, I said, it's just a warm-ups tonight. So he goes to the game and then like watches with the guys that aren't playing or are injured or whatever. And then Brody and I will just hang and yeah. So now back in the car on the road to get some food. We're gonna go to Melbourne Deli, my favorite. I'm so excited. Hopefully they're like open with, I feel like when it starts to like really snow like this, businesses will close. So hopefully, and they are not even open that late. They're open till 5.30 and it's 4.30. So we gotta go see if we can get some sandwiches. If not, I'll do like sweet green or something. And Brody and I are just gonna hang and this is so fun, I guess. Now this vlog will be our little weekend here in New Jersey, hitting up all our favorite food spots. It feels so good to be back. I'll go to Soul Saga. I literally can't wait. As long as like the snowstorm isn't too bad and things aren't like closed and canceled and stuff, we shall see. So yeah, welcome to this vlog. Here we go. <laughs> you know, <laughs> the hockey life never ceases. Ce ceases? Ceases? Ceases to amaze me. Ceases to amaze me. <laughs> Ceases to surprise me. Just gotta be on your toes last night after, cause the comic played last night, the American League, and Max played that game right after the game. He's like, oh my gosh, I just call, called up. We gotta rush home, pack up really quick. I gotta go. Give a home game tomorrow. I'm like, huh, okay. So I'm, we're like packing up stuff really quick, <laughs> like midnight, but yeah. Here we are. And hopefully we have some fun snow content. Bodhi loves the snow, don't you? Oh, it's getting so dark. I wish it was still laid out. Still open, yay. <laughs> Bag acquired. We got so lucky, you guys, because I didn't even see the sign on the door was like closing at five today because of the weather and literally got there right before five. So thank you, Melbourne Dale. Wow, it's so foggy in here for not closing on me. We appreciate it. Excuse me, can I help you? Got a little beggar on our hands, huh? Can you just relax and settle down? He knows I got food, so he's. Also think he was a little unsettled in the drive here today. He was a little anxious and probably the snow and everything didn't help. Does anyone else have a dog that's anxious in the car for car rides? Like maybe I should get him medicine at the vet. I even gave him those like calming dog treats with melatonin and stuff. I even tried putting on his little thunder jacket that he wears when there's thunderstorms because he gets scared about that. He was like this the whole way, <laughs> like shaking freaking out, which I hate that for him. But he always loves getting in the car. I think he loves going places and doing things. And I think he likes short car rides. Long car rides, I think he gets all anxious. So I don't know, does anyone else have that with their dog? So I think he's all out of whack today. He's kind of attached to my hip. Right, and we got here, like I said, saw Max left. And we sat on the couch for a second before we went to get food. And he just like cuddled up next to me and I feel like was finally like, okay, mom, we're in one spot. <laughs> Resting finally. Poor thing. Why don't you lay down? Down, take a rest. Also, our stuff has already exploded everywhere, so ignore that. Okay, let's like get in the zone here. I feel like I'm having deja vu. Was I saying that being this or was I just thinking that in my head? And last time we were here, like November or whenever Max was last up, I feel like I remember vlogging in this exact sweatshirt in this hotel, also sitting like in this exact chair at the table eating my Melbourne deli. Yes. I'm feeling so lucky that I got in there before they closed because, you know, I thought my hair was looking healthier, but I don't know if it is. Um, I would have been so sad if I missed it. I was like, thank God I'm here just in time. Okay, he's back. If you don't get the number eight, I think it's called the griller number eight when you come here, what are you doing? I got so many DMs from you guys being like, oh wait, that's not the right one. 
please hold. Got so many DMs from you guys, like saying your favorite orders from here when we come here. I also got Max, the one that he likes. It was so nice for when he comes back later. But the number eight is, in my opinion, I spilled my drink on it. I'm so excited right now. Look at her. It's like rosemary, focaccia bread, like a pesto, mayo, chicken. There you can really see. Grilled chicken, tomato, maybe either burrata or mozzarella. No, that is very naughty of you. You don't get to bark and beg. He didn't used to beg until we started giving him human food. And then he started begging. So bad. Let me just like take a good pick of this real quick. Please hold. <laughs> nice. Looking cute. Am I holding it funny? Maybe we need to like stand up. Behind the scenes of an Instagram story you probably already saw. You know when your phone like changes modes of like the camera? Like what is it doing? Okay, why is this being not how I envision in my head? Maybe we need to get it in the light more. Okay, <laughs> why does it look messy and it looks better? Get it kind of like this. Is this is so embarrassing how long it's taking me to try to get the sandwich to look cute, honor it in the way that it deserves. <laughs> it's literally the best sandwich ever. Maybe she needed flash. Is that what she needs? Maybe not. I don't know. Okay, we tried our best. Let's dig in. I'm so excited. Look at that. It's just so good. I need to make this at home. I can't believe he stopped begging. He's just laying there. He's like, okay, I'm done. I'm tired. The chicken, the lettuce, the mayo, the pesto, the tomato. Welcome to my mukbang that nobody asked for. <laughs> and it's literally like early dinner time. I haven't eaten since breakfast since we were like driving all day. Yeah, sorry. It's probably boring, but you guys are hanging out with me since I'm all alone. <laughs> The hotel, literally in a blizzard. Like the roads progressively got worse. On my way back, I was going so slow. Like I could feel it feeling slippery, you know? Which is so scary. I hate that feeling of like when the snow is piling up and you're like, oh, this is so dangerous. I need to get out of the car. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. That reminds me. We can be done with the eating show where you guys live. Are any of you Canadian? And is it like a law? To have to have winter tires on your car because last night I was at the comments game since Max played in Utica last night and my Canadian girlfriends were like, oh yeah, in, oh my gosh, where? They're like all over Canada, Ontario, Alberta, I don't know, Montreal, maybe in all of Canada or in certain places in Canada. They're like December 1st, it's a law that you have to have your like snow tires on, your winter tires, or you could probably be fined or something. Is that a thing where you guys live? I was shocked. I never heard that. But I'm like, honestly, that's so smart. That probably should be a thing everywhere where it gets snowy, you know, like anywhere. Up north, there's no lotto. Anyway, is that a thing where you guys live? I, this was the first time I heard of that. <laughs> Just staring at <laughs> Okay, bye, I've been talking for so long. This is fun. Thanks for eating Linner with me. Morning. You guys just saw went to Seoul this morning. Favorite way to start the day. And I actually wasn't even planning on going today because there's so much snow last night. I didn't know if it was gonna be like way too snowy and the roads were gonna be scary this morning. So I kind of looked at the classes in the morning and I was like, eh. But I only saw the earlier ones. I didn't see. I went to a 1045. I don't know why I didn't even see that one. And I actually booked a class for tomorrow. Then I woke up and shout out Amy, one of the sweetest girls that works at the Soul Cycle here in Short Hills, was DMing me and was like, you should go to Ava's class, 1045. And and I was like, wait a minute, I didn't even see that one. Looked it up and it was like Fred again, Odessa. I'm like, wait, this is a side. Max and I have been listening to so much Fred again. It's like on his playlist. And Odessa just, mm, nothing is better to ride to than Odessa. Like obsessed. I was like, I have to go, drop everything. So I booked last minute, like scooted on over here and it was such a good class. Shout out Ava. You guys should go to her class. And just had the best playlist, of course. Best vibe, she was so sweet. And best start to my day. I'm like smiling the whole time. <sighs> There's nothing like starting your day with SoulCycle. There like really isn't, I think, in pairs. Yeah. I always have deja vu whenever I like am, well, I guess I'm not even starting this vlog right here, but vlogging right out front of the soul in the car <laughs> since that's always how these vlogs are whenever I'm in New Jersey. And without fail, every single time Max calls me or texts me when I'm leaving a class and like has some news about hockey. So I'm always like, oh my gosh, what is it this time? I just got my text. It's all good. <laughs> I'm like, are you playing? Are you going on the road trip? Are you being sent down? What's going on? At least something. But yes, I think we're gonna go get a smoothie because why not? I'm gonna hit all my favorite spots while I'm here. There's just uh, so much more going on. Like so many restaurants, food, pliables, 
da 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 da. So obviously, saw the course right down the road. And what was I gonna say? Oh, I knew there was just the game last night, and then the next like three days before they leave for a long road trip, they go to Florida. Da, da, da. Was I saying this yesterday? I don't know. But I was like, I might as well come down for like three, four days because all my favorite things are here. So yes, love you so. See you soon. Actually, see you tomorrow probably. <laughs> Okay, I changed my mind, you guys. Got Playa. I was gonna get this smoothie out last time because it was so good, but I was like, I'm gonna do an Osable. How good does this look? I might need to take a couple of bites in the car real quick before I drive home because yum. I got the Power Osable. I think it's called Power because there's like some chocolate protein in there, banana, peanut butter. I added blueberries. Yum, this is gonna be so good. Later, and we are about to leave for New York. Last minute plan. New York. And guess City. who's coming? <laughs> yeah, I just got already a little bit earlier like right after Seoul Playa I came back and was like I might as well just get ready to do my hair and makeup because I feel like even if we don't because we kind of talked about like Should we go to New York? Or, like even if we don't I figured we'd go out to dinner So I just got already and then we're like, you know what? Let's do it and pretty much long story short We can bring Brody with because we're gonna go to Max's sister's new apartment And he is gonna stay there when we go to dinner. So yes, it's gonna be so fun wearing a new fit from mostly Princess Polly. He's ready to go. <laughs> gray Pico, Princess Polly, gray long sleeve, like dark gray. I love this, Princess Polly. A little bit more low waisted jeans, Princess Polly. <laughs> kind of crazy. Oh, he's ready. He's ready. And then my blue sambas that Max got me for I Christmas. And then, yeah, and then I'm happy I grabbed this from the Kate to bring back because it goes so well. And this is a scarf I got a winter or two ago. And it's the brand Acne. Studios. I want to say act me. That's not right. Anyway, yeah, that's the fit. Gotta grab my bag. Max is packing Brody a little to go container of food. Up we go. And Max is copying me with the gray pea coat. Aren't you? I believe you, you're copying. Were you? What? You were definitely inspired by my outfit. No. No, these are just the two pea coats that we have here. Sorry, I literally barely filmed last night. I literally just showed our food. We went to this Italian place called Uva in the Upper East Side and it was so good, so good. The best vibes, you sat in like the back little patio area. It was like covered with lights and heaters and stuff and it was so cute and so good, so it was amazing. And honestly, so easy to get in and out of the city and took us like less than 40 minutes to get back since it was like less traffic because it was later. Guess where I am, shocker. <laughs> <laughs> We're back, baby. I was like, I'm sore. Can I come back? And then I was like, you know what? I can't because when I'm not here, I go back to you to get a day. I'm gonna miss it. So, we're back. And oh, I think I said yesterday I took Ava and she's amazing. And today I'm taking Roger. I haven't taken him before, so it'll be great. Okay, let's head in. Wait a minute. Is no one gonna tell me there's like this big smudge on my camera? How long has that been there? Probably from it like being in the cold. I feel like it's still there. What did I do to my camera? Maybe it's not? What kind of is? Okay, I need to figure that out. But Soul was great. Love to the playlist. Love Roger's energy. They're like upbeat. So fun. Just grab bagels from the bagel shop like down the street a little bit. Called Bagels For You. It's gonna be so good. Got Max and I bagel sandwiches. And a little sweet one to share. Yeah, I see the smudge now. This is driving me nuts. So we're getting boxwood coffee. I'm gonna bring the bagels. We have a morning little brunch date. Here we go. Look who it is. <gasps> Brody. It's me. Good morning, puppy. Here we are. Woo. Isn't this such a cute little area? <laughs> Just me. They had a sign that said no dogs. So you were like, dang it. <laughs> to have his big face. Hi, big breather. <laughs> okay, how is it? Wonderful. Is it actually really good? Wonderful. Max is starting with the French toast. Oh. Sweet one. Oh, we literally can't see. Oh, that lighting. Yeah, it's not good. Shout out all the girls at Seoul that were giving me their order recommendations. Mm. I was like, okay, now we need to get five bagels. <laughs> they said oh, the French yeah. toast ones were really good. I Are forgot they? this wasn't from uh, I don't know. What ain't the wrapper? Bagel haul. You mm. forgot this wasn't from Boxwood. Mm -hmm. So I got these first. And then here are our Boxwood. Mm -hmm. Coffees. Guys, guess what I just did? I feel like whenever I get their lattes, they don't have enough ice. And Starbucks is right there, so I just ran into Starbucks and asked for a cup of ice. 
and added it. I always get their ice vanilla latte oat milk like I normally mm -hmm. do, but for last time I got their honey cinnamon latte. It tastes actually pretty similar. It's so good. Can you back up, boy? Mouth breather in our face. Back up. Why don't you try yeah, it? Yeah, this thing looks milky. Yup. Okay, I'm gonna try the French toast. This lighting is horrible. Excuse me. <laughs> He wasn't allowed in the coffee shop. How rude. I know. And you do the coffee, they're like, please bring him in. And here, there was like a big sign on the door. It was like, no dogs. We're like, no. Except service. Which you are. We need to get him service train. That's the goal of this year. Look at this face. But easy. Yum. <laughs> Holy okay. bagel. Yum. I'm going to stop vlogging because this lady is not good. Bye. Back in the car. All bundled up. Hey. <laughs> Didn't even vlog earlier, but Max and I went to Montclair and he helped me take pictures. And I didn't vlog purposely because I was wearing the exact same outfit that I wore last night. And I didn't want them to see me the same, see me wear the same outfit, but I wanted pictures of it. And it dark last night, so yes. Now we are going to the park. We're going to the park. The park? Yeah. Yeah. Yes, 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 yes. The park. <laughs> me coming to you live right here and now as you saw just made my dinner my hello fresh this is gonna be so yummy to have a nice home cooked meal and it actually worked out perfect timing when max got called up and we went on the road because we had one hello fresh meal left over from our last week and i knew i was just gonna be gone for a couple days and that i can make it when i got back so that's what this is and it was so nice to have like a nice home cooked meal on this like crazy travel day back so yes i figured i probably shouldn't bring it with me on a four hour car ride. I figured it would probably go bad. So yes, yeah, so that's why we're inserting this right here and now. Thank you so much HelloFresh for sponsoring this video. One of my most favorite dinners are HelloFresh because they are just so tasty. They have the best recipes. Honestly as well for my lifestyle, like moving around so chaotic. If I had just a little bit of heads up, like obviously they call you that day. They're like, you're getting called up, go right now. I would have changed the address of delivery to be New Jersey because they did have a little kitchen there. And I was also worried if I tried to get like a cooler bag and pack stuff. I don't think they have like a cookie sheet or like like there's very limited kitchen things in the hotel anyway all that is to say health fresh is so convenient you can change the delivery dates if i have to cancel like oh my gosh i'm gonna go out of town you can cancel at any time change your delivery address and this one right here that we made is the monterey jack unfried chicken which i made this one before delicious i just always love their chicken ones they taste like a warm hug <laughs> like i don't know how else to describe it. i think like i don't but in the effort to make like a nice home cooked meal for myself if it's not hello fresh i just eat the most random stuff so i appreciate them so much whether your new year's resolution is to eat tastier just nutritious whole dinners or stress less or not have to worry about grocery jobs so much hello fresh has you covered okay they cover all three like just so convenient like i said and you saw when i was unpacking the ingredients um in this bag my memory card cut off i was saying that their meals come with pre-portioned ingredients, which means less food waste. They are farm fresh ingredients, chef crafted recipes that are so delicious. I love scrolling through my app each week and picking out my recipes. You guys know I always do that. And lastly, I know you guys, if you haven't seen, they actually have breakfast items now. They think breakfast is the most important meal of the day. And I agree. And you guys have to try their egg bites that I've been trying. They're so good. I think my favorite that I've had is like the cheddar bacon ones. I can insert some footage, but I know I have one left in the fridge right there. They're breakfast items are so good actually i know as a new subscriber for hellofresh you can get free breakfast for life which is crazy so if you guys go to hellofresh.com and use my code ggyt free you'll get 
free breakfast for life, which basically with a active subscription for HelloFresh, you're gonna get a free breakfast item in each box. So again, use GGYT free for a free breakfast item in each of your HelloFresh boxes. I'm gonna dig in, this <laughs> is probably getting cold. I've been chatting so much here, but honestly, this is good. I'm letting it cool off because normally I eat my food like blistering hot and like burn the roof of my mouth. Mmm, doesn't get better than this. Brody's running over. Anything with sriracha mayo, immediately yes. Wow, this is good. This like ranch seasoning on the potatoes. I could eat a thousand of these. That's what the green beans. Do you see that little nodes right there? That's Brody. I don't think any of this is good for dog use. Like maybe a potato or green bean. I don't think the seasonings are good for doggies. I'm sorry. Okay, let's get in here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna eat my dinner. Yeah. Let's get back in to the rest of the video. Just like one more day in New Jersey. We're back. Oh no, Brody, not for you. Back, Brody, back. <laughs> uh, guy in there had the same. Same coat as me. I've never seen it out in the wild before. Wow! But what his had the uh, the red logo. Logo? Yeah. Oh wow! Oh, hi there. Do you know his vlog? No. I don't even know if my vlog would know that story. I don't know if I was vlogging. Long story short, when we were in New York, Max wanted like a lightweight jacket, and they didn't like have any out. And then the yeah, or any good ones. Yeah, and then the security guy working there, Max was like, I like that one. Yeah. And then he and got, they had it in the back, and yeah. I got it. Yeah, I got the one. So now it's your security guard jacket. Yep. Okay, we're back. Hi, it's the next day. Melbourne Deli. Are we eating you right here? You can't see tonight. Well, we could like have a bite. Here, I want you to see when it's raining. There it is. Oh, we must be near a train. Hello. I already did a full mukbang with them at the beginning of this vlog. Whoa. So maybe I won't do that right now. But yum. The number eight, as usual. I got the, the J Ray. The Ray J? The J Ray. And, oh, you can stick it in. Maybe I need a bite of mm. that one. Tell them what's in it. Chicken cutlet, cheese, barbecue sauce, chipotle mayo. Brody, what about us? We want a bite. Mmm. Mm -hmm. Yum. Yum. This whole vlog is us in the car with Brody, going to get food. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. There's just not much to show in the hotel room. Wow. So. Yeah, I went to the gym this morning. Max had a really hard practice. Probably gonna go nap. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's up. <laughs> right? Just got back from dinner. Full. Me too. You're about to say stuffed. Yeah. Me too. It was really good. We went to the Standard. The Milburn. The Milburn Standard. And didn't even bring my camera because we went with two Max's teammates and their girlfriends. And it was so fun. Mm -hmm. It was, it was fun. great. It really started raining today. It's been so rainy all day. And I think all of us are probably like, uh, getting ready for dinner. Mm -hmm. But I'm happy we went. Yeah. And I yummy chicken Caesar salad. That French onion soup was really good. Yes, it was. Yeah. Cheesy. And like, I was shocked I was so hungry, even after the Melbourne Deli yeah. sandwich. So that was so yum. And now we might have to eat some cookie dough. I don't think we even showed that last night. Yeah, we, oh no, that you were doing a TikTok. Yeah, some cookie dough that we got from Whole Foods last mm -hmm. night. We might need to go eat some of those. But I think I'm gonna end off this vlog here. Cool, since we're both packing and leaving tomorrow. Yeah, out of here. Neato. And I believe HelloFresh went earlier in the video, but I'm gonna film that mm. in the future. But in this video, you will have already seen out of order. Because <laughs> I knew I couldn't yeah. bring HelloFresh. I guess I could, but it wouldn't have stayed mm. cool. You know what I mean? Mm. Anyway. Okay. Alrighty. Gonna end up this vlog here. See you in 10 days. Yep. Will you miss me? Yep. Great. I'll miss you too. <laughs> okay, bye. <laughs>